Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of my playthrough for Final Fantasy VIII. Uh, in this episode, we are going to focus on uh, a little side quest. Well, it's actually not that little. Um, it's pretty important. Um, but for that, we're going to have to go to Balam Garden. Uh, and to go to Balam Garden, we have to go to Fisherman's Horizon first. Uh, and then we can just land in Fisherman's Horizon. It's going to take a while before we reach Balam Garden, but it's, it's fine. Uh, this is a side quest that I think is rather important. If I'm not mistaken, this is probably one of the more important side quests, uh, which is why I want to finish this as soon as possible. This is going to be a card game side quest in which we are going to obtain quite a lot of useful cards. However, um, I'm going to... When I reach Balam Garden, I'm probably going to have to... You know, edit this video and cut the video because... There are going to be some things that I need to do first, but I will explain it once we get there. I also forgot to read out that conversation, but it's not that important. <laughs> but yeah, we, we really need this, um, this side quest. The side quest will allow us to uh, have and battle um, very powerful card game players. And the more powerful the card game players are, the more powerful their cards are. And the more powerful their cards, the more powerful the weapons and spells that we get from them. Which is why this uh, side quest is so important. Now this may or may not be a rather boring episode for you guys. I apologize for it if it is, but these things have to be done. And I mean, it's, it's, I guess it can be fun to watch, to watch some card games, right? <laughs> but yeah, what we're gonna have to do is we're gonna go to the first floor. And we need to have played, um, I think it's like 15 games. I had to look it up just to be sure. I think it was 15 games around Bellum Garden. And once you've done that, you can actually talk to one of the one of the people walking this this garden, uh, and they're actually hidden um, hidden CC group members. So these these uh, groups are secret groups. Um, consisting of very, very talented card game players. I'm going to quickly show you guys these two. This guy and these two girls are part of the of the secret group, I guess. But however, if you talk to them right now, uh, he's only going to talk about the CC group. Um, he's going to ask you whether the CC group has challenged you yet. Um, it doesn't matter what you say here. Um, I'm just going to say yes because I, I'm explaining it to you guys right now. So the CC group is a hidden group um, who is going to, they're going to t um, challenge you once the time is ready. And basically what you have to do is you're going to have to keep challenging players until you've won, I think, 15 battles. Once you've done that, you can go back and talk to that guy and he's going to challenge you to a card game. And he's going to reveal that he is part of the card game group, I guess. So what I'm probably going to do here is I'm going to challenge this guy right here um, until I've won 15 games. Uh, and then I'm going to edit this video and I'm going to come back when when everything is set up properly. Right? So I'll see you guys in just a few seconds here. Alright guys, so once you've uh, played enough games and you speak to this man, he's going to say, Yo! Looks like you're doing pretty good at, with the card games. It's almost time. Oh, alright. Squall, I challenge you. I'm CC Groups Jack. You appear to be a worthy opponent. Tell me when you're ready with Square. Alright, so as I said, he's a, he's a member of the CC group. So once you've challenged him um, and you won against him, then you can challenge all the other players as well. Um, if I'm not mistaken, I know all of them. But I'm not too sure. It may be possible that I have to look it up really quick. But yeah, anyways, um, you're just going to have to battle them. I'm going to do this really quick. And even though they have powerful cards at this point in the game, if you followed my playthrough, uh, then you should have more powerful cards. And you shouldn't have too much trouble beating him. Um, I'm just going to do this. And this is an easy one. Alright. Uh, some of these players have um, very special cards as well, so... I lost. You're really good. 
but don't think you've defeated the C3C group yet. There are six members in the CC group I haven't defeated. The first is the card master and the CC group's leader, King. And the others are called the four suits, card knight club, card prince spade, card prince princess diamond, and card queen heart. And then there is card magician joker, whose ability is still a mystery, even to me. Now that you've defeated me, I'm sure that it'll show up soon. Good luck to you, maybe you'll be successful. Alright, so now we are going to have to find the second uh, group. I think... Okay, so these are not the second ones. I think the second one is maybe towards the left here, somewhere. Um, it's definitely not that little boy. <laughs> I'm going to have to look... I'm going to have to search as well, but I'm not too sure. I think he's hiding somewhere in this area. Maybe it's even him. Yeah, there you go. It's been a while since someone beat Jack. I'm Club, one of the four CC Knights. Do you dare challenge me? Press square to challenge me. Yeah, of course. We're gonna challenge him and we're gonna beat him as well. Now, he doesn't have a special card, so you can just go ahead and beat him. You don't have to worry about anything. And even the ones that do, uh, there's always... Later on in the game, you can still win all those cards back, so you don't have to worry too much. Just try to focus on winning the, the games and you should be fine. Um, yeah, it's fine. We win. Alright, nice. Not bad, but beware. There are many players far better than me in the CC group. Alright, so I think... I'm not sure who I'm supposed to challenge next. I think we're gonna have to go back and challenge the two ladies at the front. Though I'm not too sure. I know there's, there's also one in the training room. But I'm not sure when exactly we're supposed to beat him. I guess we'll find out. Um... Well, since these guys aren't showing up, I'm just gonna check the CC. Uh, I'm just gonna check the training room first. But yeah, this, this episode is going to consist of only card games. So, I'm sorry if you find it boring. <laughs> but, yeah, like I said, it is quite important. Oh yeah, there he is. I think this is the next one that we have to that we have to challenge. Hopefully, we don't face uh, the T Rex. But okay, thank thank God. Oh, I forgot to equip my Guardian forces. Yeah, I need to do that as soon as possible. All right. So now we can go ahead and continue and challenge this uh, this next player. However, this next player does have a very special card. He has the Leviathan card. So hopefully he plays it the very first time. You're Squall, huh? I heard about you. Is there anything you want? It's not free, of course. Oh boy, he doesn't he doesn't do it just yet. I think we have to face someone else first. <laughs> We're gonna have to come back here later. It's fine. Oh boy, it's the T-Rex. Hopefully, though, I can actually finish him in one hit. No. Let me try it again. Maybe if I... Uh, if I use... Do I have a Zuna here? No, I don't. I wonder if the generator will work against him. Oh, it does. Nice. Alright. So I'm gonna quickly go ahead and uh, heal up my party members. Um, so, eye drops, echo screen. 
There we go. And heal up a little bit. And I think it was Leviathan who learned Magic Junction. Yeah, it was. So I think I'm gonna learn Spirit plus 20% next. And let's continue. Yeah, like I said, I, I have to refresh my memory. If if I f if I don't find the next um, the next person to battle, I'm probably gonna edit the video again and I'm gonna look it up first. I thought I wanted to figure it out by myself. Hopefully they appear right now. Okay, they do. So unfortunately, we're gonna have to wait until they settle down towards the end here, before we can actually challenge them. All right. Are you surprised? That's right. We are Card Princess Diamonds. We're the Diamond Duo. We respect your card playing ability. We challenge you. Press square to play. We're definitely going to play them as well. Uh, they do not have um, a special card, so you can just go ahead and beat them. But as you can see, they're playing quite good cards already, which is good. Gonna do this. There you go. Easy win, baby. Nice. Alright, so as you can see, these players or these matches aren't too difficult, but they do have very good cards. So, yeah. I can't remember the last time we've been defeated. Ever since Headmaster Sid. But there are still two of us left. Alright, so I think now we're gonna have to go back to the training center. Um, just, just a second. I I'm probably gonna edit this video out. Uh, but I'm just gonna look it up really quick. Just to not waste your time. <laughs> All right, so I think we do have to go to the training center. I'm not even sure if it matters because in the YouTube video that I just watched, <laughs> he did it in a different order. I'm not too sure though. But yeah, anyways, I think we were going to have to go to the training center. He seems to be the only one left. Oh, unfortunately, he doesn't always spawn. So let's try this again. I wonder if I have encounter half. Probably not. I still need to fix my guardian forces, man. I keep forgetting. But it's fine. It's fine. Yeah, there's really not a lot to say here. I'm doing my best. <laughs> but yeah, the, the side quest itself is pretty straightforward. Yeah, there you go. Um, so I'm gonna check just to see if we have the encounter half ability. No, we don't. Okay. That explains a lot. Um, so Renoa has it. Let me just quickly take it off from Renoa. And I'm gonna give it to Quistus. mug all right cool let's see if he actually ch um, plays us this time wow even even with encounter half we, we still end up in a fight luckily the monsters here aren't too difficult though i mean even the t-rex Saurus, which gave us a lot of trouble in the beginning even he is not that big of an issue now which is good Uh, was that brothers? I'm not too sure. I think it was. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna teach him. Mm. HP bonus is probably good because I'm I'm going to do some grinding very soon. Wait. There you go. Hey, 
Heard you've been playing some good games. Sure, you wanna play? What? The CC group? Yeah, I am a member. I'm Card Magician Joker. As my name says, I'm the black sheep of the group. Let's go ahead and challenge him. Oh, you got a battle meter. I'll add another function to it if you win. Wanna play? Yeah, sure. Alright, so like I said earlier, this guy does have a very special card. He has the Leviathan card. Hopefully he does use it. Unfortunately, he didn't use it. Uh, but it's fine. I'm gonna challenge him after this fight. I'm just gonna challenge him again until I win the card. Because it is a very important card. We want as many special cards as possible. Um, yeah, this should be an easy one. Nice. Alright. You're really good. Well, I promise a promise. Let me see that battle meter. There you go. Now you can view GF information with it. Alright, so he upgraded our battle meter. Um, but we're gonna play him again. Uh, until he uses the Leviathan card again. If it takes too long, I'm probably gonna edit it out. So you guys don't have to worry about it too much. Okay, so he finally used his uh, used the special card, Leviathan. Uh, let's go ahead and see if we can uh, if we can uh, steal it away from him. Um, I'm just gonna play it safe here. Yeah, this should be a W. Nice. All right. So we got another special card here, and we got some more powerful cards. I think we don't have this one yet, and this one as well. Yeah, three new cards, well, four in total. Alright, so once you've done that, you can finally leave this area. And wow, even, even with encounter half, my encounter rate is pretty high. Anyways. I think the last... Uh, the last person we have to challenge... Well, it's not actually the last one, but I think it's uh, Xu, if I'm not mistaken. Let's go ahead and see if that's true, or if my memory is completely messing with me. <laughs> In order to find Xu, we're gonna have to go to the uh, third floor. Let's go ahead and do that really quick. Yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed this um, this playthrough so far. Uh, I know that not every episode is going to be as interesting as the others, but yeah, like I said so many times, some of these parts are just really important to do. Um, I will be doing some more grinding and farming after this episode. So if you see me in the next episode, you'll probably see that I'm I've gotten a little bit stronger. I'm not going to overdo it, but... Yeah, I will do some grinding because I really need it. <laughs> Anyways, uh, let's see if um, she challenges us. No, unfortunately not. Unfortunately not. So I'm gonna have to look it up really quick on YouTube. <laughs> Alright, so unfortunately I was wrong. I still I have to challenge this guy first. <laughs> He's at the second floor. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and do that really quick. Yes, I am one of the four suits of CC Group, Card Knights Paid. It's been a while since someone made it this far. Shall we start? As you already know, please press, press square to challenge me. Alright, let's go ahead and do that really quick. Yeah, my memory completely failed me. I'm very sorry. I'm sorry if this episode is completely like chaotic and stuff. Like, I, I know that this episode is, is not going to be as good. <laughs> I'm very sorry about that, but I'm doing my best. Uh, I don't know what's wrong with me today. <laughs> yeah, let's go ahead and beat him. As you can see, he's using the, uh, the card, the, the Propagator, which we had to battle just a, a little bit ago in the previous episode. Um, yeah, this should be a W. Nice. Alright. Wow, you're good. I accept defeat. I can tell you've collected and played cards all over the world. And you remind me of her. Her talent especially. 
Oh, now I've said too much. Well, there is one more suit for you to defeat, but Hart is no ordinary player. She became the top player of CC Group in only three months. She is a true genius. You two seem to have a similar learning ability. Well, now that I've bored you with too much detail, I shall leave. So long. Alright, so... He has already... Wait. Please come by here anytime to play cards with me again. I'm always up for a good game. See you. Alright, so he already spoiled that the final... Um, the final challenger is going to be a woman. So let's go ahead and uh, see who she is. Well, I actually spoiled it earlier. It's on the third floor. <laughs> it should be Sue or Zu. I'm not sure how to pronounce her name. So let's go ahead and challenge her and hopefully... Oh, there you go. Oh, Squall. I'm a bit surprised. I didn't, I didn't think Spade would lose. But this is good. I haven't been able to find a worthy opponent lately. That's right. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Sue, otherwise known as the CC Group Card Queen Heart. Whenever you're ready, let's go. All right, let's go ahead and challenge her. Uh, she does have a, a special card. I think she has the Carbungle card, if I'm not mistaken. Hopefully she uses this. Yeah, there you go. It's at the very top there. Um, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna try to play it safe. I'm gonna put Cyphered at the top left here. Nice. Um, I think this is a good. Ch oh, never mind. <laughs> that was bad. Um, I'm just gonna continue to play it safe. This should be a win either way. So. All right. Very nice. Got another Guardian Force card is really good defeat I knew this day would come but ah. oh well you're only the second person to defeat me the other C the other is the CC group leader King the card master now that you've defeated the four suits you'll eventually play the king maybe you can look for the king yourself well let's play for fun from now on Alright, so there is one more um, card game player, which is the king. And the king can only be found if you've done something in specific order, I guess. Uh, you're going to have to go to the first floor. And we're actually going to have to go to our dormitories. So let's go ahead and do that really quick. And once you've done that, uh, once you've reached... Uh, once you've reached the dormitory, you can actually go ahead and, um, and and take a break. Once you've taken a break, then you'll end up meeting the final group member. I'm not going to spoil who it is just yet, but it was a surprise in my first playthrough. Well, in my first playthrough, I didn't even know about the side quest, but you know what I mean. <laughs> Alright, so let's go ahead and rest. Um, I don't know why it doesn't work. Okay, so finally it worked. Uh, it seems like I had to go to the infirmary first and talk to Dr. Kadawaki. Uh, she will then let you know that she used to be the king, but she passed it on to another girl. Uh, so when, when you go to the dormitory then and you take a break, eventually you'll find this uh, conversation right here. So you defeated the four suits. You've proven yourself worthy. And surprise, surprise. The CC group leader, the card master king, is I, Quistus Streep, all decked out in my uniform. Squall, you are really something. I can't believe how much your game has improved. I knew you were destined to play. Let's begin. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, challenge her. Uh, she has another very important card, probably one of the most important cards, which is the Gilgamesh card. Unfortunately, she didn't use this, the card right now, but uh, we're just going to try to finish um, 
finish this side quest and then continue to uh, to challenge her to a battle until until she uses the card because it's a really good card. Refining the Gilgamesh card is going to give you 10 hero wars. And what a hero war does is it turns your entire party invincible for I don't know how many minutes. But it's going to be crucial in in disc four. Even disc three. But yeah, once we get there, I'll I'll show you guys. Um, but yeah, this should be a win. Nice. I can't believe I lost. Don't get too cocky just yet. We can challenge each other as equals from now on. I'm always up for a game, but only in the garden cockpit. See you later, Squall. Alright, so that was the CC card game quest, I guess. Now, we're not done just yet because we're gonna we're gonna challenge her until she uses the Gilgamesh card. Yeah, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to edit quite a bit out in this episode <laughs> because I just messed it up. Yeah, I don't know what was wrong with me. I should have looked it up first, but sometimes I think to myself that getting lost in a playthrough can also be quite enjoyable as well. Though maybe that's just me. <laughs> but I will try to do my, my research ahead of time in, in the next episodes because I can I can understand that this episode may not have been a very pleasant episode to watch, uh, which I apologize for. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead and challenge her really quick. Until she finally uses the card that we want her to use. Unfortunately, she doesn't. She didn't use it. Uh, I'm gonna have to edit this out as well until she finally uses the card that I wanted to use, and I'll see you guys in a few seconds. All right, so she finally used the Gilgamesh card uh, at the very top there. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do the exact same thing, uh, just our regular strategy. Hopefully, we can uh, win this card as soon as possible. Well, I have no choice. If I lose. I'm gonna have to restart this entire episode, which is not gonna be too fun. <laughs> but yeah, we, we should be fine. We should be fine. I'm gonna do this. And yeah, that should be a win. Nice. Alright, so we have done everything that we can do here. Uh, let's go back to the Ragnarok. Now, what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to end the episode right here um, because I'm going to do some more grinding uh, and I'm going to do some more farming as well. I'm not going to do too much, but I'm, I am going to do a significant amount. So in the next episode, you'll probably see that I'm quite stronger than in this episode. Uh, but yeah, like I said, for now, I wanted to apologize if this episode was a bit, uh, a bit chaotic. Um, but yeah, I, I, I hope I hope you understand, you know. <laughs> so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Alright, have a nice day.